Hello, and thank you for coming. My name is Jude Lawson um, at First St. Mary's School, and my, and my COVID, my science fair pro project was on um, which material masks work, and my title for my project is called COVID Walkers. So my hypothesis was that I used three types of masks. So I used thick cloth, cloth, and nylon mask. And my hypothesis was, was the nylon mask would do the best because it has more strings and they're more tightly compacted. And my variables were uh, the type of masks, the distance between the flame and the, and the aerosol sprayer, um, the amount of fluid coming out of the aerosol sprayer, and the, the amount of flame coming out of the torch. So the a brief overview of what I did was I put a I put a butane torch on a shepherd's pole, and I measured out six feet with with a measuring tape. And when I was at six feet, I moved up six feet each time. To I did I did six, uh, one for each foot, and so one was with nylon mask, one was with thick cloth mask, one was not with thick cloth mask with cloth mask. And one was just with nothing on. So, um, after the results came in, uh, what my res my hypothesis was incorrect. Um, the nylon mask actually saturated and leaked. About like the first thing it did was saturate and leak. However, all of them worked. The nylon mask saturated and leaked. The best one was actually the thick cloth mask. Um, and I learned later in my research that was because it had more, it, ha it did have more strings and they were tightly compacted, but the one for the nylon mask were, were for elastic purposes instead of blocking them out. So a bit of background research was that I work, I look at the CDC and, and a uh, Chinese scientist named Dr. Peter Shin Hong and the New England Journal of Medicine. And I, all, I pretty much got the exact same thing, um, but to quote Peter Chin Hong, all masks work. The, the thing that you want to do is you want to find a mask that fits your face and is comfortable to wear so that it can stay on your face and you're not touching it every two seconds. However, all three warned against the N95 masks because of the seam in the middle. And I can conclude because I, because I did a bit of, I, I did like one trial with that one, uh, that that one did not, did, didn't really work because of the seam in the middle. So my materials were a shepherd's pole, a nylon mask, thick cloth mask, cloth mask, zip ties, foam head, aerosol ether, spray gun, tape measure, nails, and a fire extinguisher in, just in case. So thank you, thank you for your time, and I look forward to seeing the results.